gotten several of these family packs of ground beef uh, on a manager special at my local store and they need to be stored promptly because they are close to the sell by date. So we're going to go ahead and portion these up and use the food saver to get them safely sealed and into the freezer quickly. We're going to be using the pre-cut bags from the food saver line in the quart size for each pound to pound and a quarter of ground beef. And if I were to use a bigger portion of hamburger, I would go ahead and cut my own size bag. But just for uh, time saving sake, we're going to use the pre-cut bags this time. So now that we have the hamburger in our bags, we're going to go ahead and turn on our unit. And because the hamburger is slightly moist, we're going to turn it to moist. You can pre-freeze softer foods like soups and really juicy meats, but the ground beef tends to do pretty well on moist. We're going to insert the bag into the machine. Two hands works better and you want to make sure there are no wrinkles. And this is the bag having all the air taken out of it. Really simple. After all the air has been taken out, the little red light will come on telling us that it's time to seal. And it's now heat sealing the bag. We're done. There's a seam along the top and the air has been taken out of our meat. And then if you need it to lay flatter in the freezer like I sometimes do for storage, I flatten that meat down just a little bit more. You can see along the edges there's no air in there at all. It looks very, very beautiful and just took a second. So now you can see that we've gone from the big pack that our butcher put together and turn it into three smaller packages more likely to be used in one or two meals and there will be a lot less waste this way and a lot more efficient than my wax paper and foil method that I've been using to wrap up my meat portions in the past few years. It was a, a lot quicker, I feel safer about just keeping the air out and I really feel like it will actually lay a little bit better in my freezer allowing for more storage potential.